Second award, prototype. Going to welcome uh, Dan O'Brien, Venture Capital and Startup Business Development Award. <laughs> what a room full of sycophants. Hi, Dan. How are you? Very well. Gosh. Love this room. Um, uh, Venture Capital and Startup Business Development New Zealand, AWS. Uh, here is the prize. The prize for winning the Prototype Award is $10,000. Sponsored by Field Days. Don't just award the, applaud the value. Uh, oh, there's more. They also get a machine learning kit to get started with exciting computer vision, IoT and other experiments and a session with an expert at AWS who will help them get uh, started prototyping and give you advice on accessing AWS support programs sponsored by AWS and product design and development services to the value of $5,000 sponsored by a Blender Design. What about a round of applause for those generous sponsors? We have a highly commended so feel free not to advance the slide. Give it away. <laughs> Highly commended, we would like to commend SPS Automation for the impressive way that they are implementing AI tools to enable massive improvements in the control of invasive plant species in Aotearoa. How about a round of applause for SPS Automation? <laughs> Who is the winner? I'm... We're going to show you on the screen, but I'm going to read it out first. That was, that was called dramatic tension. I'm the master of creating dramatic tension. All right. The winner of the 2003 Field Days Innovation Awards Prototype Award is, from amongst many of their entries, Waikato Milking Systems with the Ergopods. The judges said, aimed at both the local and international market, the Ergopod provides a step change in milking and revolutionises the way cups are presented and managed in the milking shed. It exemplifies what can be achieved when solid design is combined with innovative idea generation, deliberate simplification and effective root cause analysis. With just the right amount of automation, the Ergopod reduces injury risks halves the time to apply milking cups, removes multiple hazards for a cow entering and leaving the milking platform, creates opportunities for precise measurement and control of milk quality, and even speeds up the process of cows exiting a rotary milking platform. The end result is an internationally viable product that enables faster, safer milking by a wider labour pool. Congratulations, Waikato Milking Systems. Good evening, everyone, um, and um, thanks very much for the, the award. Um, I'd like to thank the Field Days, uh, the judges, the sponsors, of course, um, and then also Tom and his team here. Um, we started on this journey about four years ago, and um, we had this crazy idea that um, if we were going to be the most um, admired company globally for um, milking efficiency, if we could milk a thousand, if a single operator could milk a thousand cows an hour, um, that would be a game changer. And the machine that you see up here, we think we're on a, a good way for that. Um, we believe that um, this this is a fifty million dollar business in only a few years from now. So, um, well done to the team, and um, very happy to accept this award. Thanks very much. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Brilliant. Tell you what, if that was around when I was milking, I would probably still be milking. I actually, when COVID came and, and work stopped, my family was short of milker, and I said I could come home and milk, and they said, no thanks. 